Hello, welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda, where in the last episode we arrived on the Asari Arc Lysinia and found out that they're still here, but uh, they have cats that are hunting them and some of them are on board and we'll have to help them uh, figure out how to leave here because there's some systems that are malfunctioning and... Ouch. Yeah, that's bright. Ironic. The electrical junction is damaged. I recommend searching for an alternative. Are we over there? Can't see a way to fix it. Any luck, Ryder? Whatever this power is, the Ark needs fire control more. There. Let's try again. That should cool us off. Videri again. I got the cat. They got me back, but I'm okay. Nice work. And with the hangar shut, I managed to track the real power drain. Here's the nav point. I'll see you there. All right. Captain Atandra here. We're warming up the drive core, but we need more juice. We're on it, Captain. Good. The Valiant ship is still out there somewhere. We've lost so many, and Matriarch Ashara. It can't be for nothing. Not planning on letting that happen. Some engineer left before she could clean up her workbench. These components were taken from ARC systems, including power distribution. Explains the problems we're having. What could be worth gutting the ARC? Service collision of two planes using ME field test configuration. NAS access by assistant engineer Lapras to Carl. Not sure. Get 12 hull plating sheared. Atmosphere was vented. No time to put for, for, or personnel to weld. 100 plus trap. No suits. No time. Can't be done. Can be done. No one else does today. Want to grab the cat by the throat and shake them. Keep dreaming, skinny. Should have been a hunter. Scrap. Grab. Hold the deck plating in place. Not airtight, but enough for breathers. So. Currently trying to maintain life support here. Evac comes to down doing, doing this the old fashioned way. We cannot finish the evac with deck 12 in that condition. The last cat barrage sheared the hull plating, the atmosphere that's hanging by your thread. Got a hundred people trapped on the other side and not enough suits. There's children. Well, I can't make that call. I won't. There's also a response. Jonah Lapras just showed up. The screwball engineer refused to evacuation. She says she's got an idea. For maintenance to Kola to Yaksan. Headed off arc soon to give those cats something to chase. Oh, gear got, got to shit in the last encounter, but old habits make me stick it all and recharge. Do me a favor, keep it away from the civvies, would you? No sense someone coming all this way and then shooting themselves in the foot. Okay. Kill those logs that I was reading to myself, you know? Looks like an observation deck. For observing the mess they made of the place? People must have evacuated from the deck beyond. <clears throat> Ryder, over here. Oh good. I was wondering if they were cat around, but apparently not cat around only you I'll be, I'll be back with you in a sec I feel like there's a firefight coming Doesn't seem like we'll be able to do something about that right now. All right. You were saying? Thank the goddess, you're all right. Here, this is what's draining the power. 
What is this thing? It looks like the cat attack sheared off some hull plating. Then someone rigged up this Mass Effect field device. The field's so strong, it holds the hull together. It would help people evacuate the deck beyond. Alright, explains the logs that, that I've kind of found. And give anyone sensitive to Mass Effect fields a nasty migraine. No kidding. But they'd survive. The deck's deserted now. We have to turn the device off. I tried pulling the plug, but nothing. Can you scan it? Maybe your Sam can figure it out. The device requires two people for shutdown. One disconnecting the cables, and another at the device itself. I'll handle the device. Caution. Once begun, the failsafe cycle must be completed, or the device will fuse. That's not good. Disconnecting the first. Ready, Vidaria? Disconnecting the first cable now. Cat! Watch the device. We'll handle them. But we need you, Vidaria. You can do this. Okay, next cable, ready when you are. Let's check the one on the other side next. Rider, this must be the last of them. Just die already. Can now be deactivated. All right. That noise, it's gone. If anyone asks, it was like that when we got here. It's Captain Atandra. Ryder, the drive core is coming online. You did it. A few minutes, and we're out of here. I'll take a breather once we're at the Nexus. That's smart. 
At least sensors are clear for now. Sarissa here. Superb work, all of you. We're almost home. It's really over. I should go and help. There might be something I can do. You did a really good job here today. You helped save this whole arc. Not bad for your first big mission. Sarissa should be proud, Vidaria. You'll be one hell of a commando. You'd know, Lieutenant. Thank you for everything. Goddess guide you. Pathfinder, restoring power has freed up a data cache. It includes the succession log from Matriarch Ishara. Right. Can you access it? Forget the data. I need you. The barrier's collapsing. Ishara, they'll tear the Ark apart. I... That data is the only thing that might buy us time. Had reinforcements approaching Pathfinder Ishara. Sarissa! My Samka! Tiamna! Please! I have to save them, even if I can't save... Forgive me. Tiavna used to mean guardian of temples, a champion who stayed faithful even when all was lost. Sarissa left her to die. I still think it was kind of a necessary decision. She apparently needed to make a choice between saving a crew or probably letting everyone die. So I don't think I can hold that against her. Sarissa was forced to choose between her Pathfinder and her Ark. She made the right call. Look around. Does this look like a right call? I... Damn it all, Ryder. What do I do? First, we... Set an alarm sound. The cat hunters blindsided us. They have a dropship headed for the breach on deck 12. On it. How long until we have FTL? Too long. Sarissa's coming to help. Push him back. Helmets on, people. Caution. The mass effect field device is still connected. Remotely triggering it may affect local gravity. Could be useful. That's interesting. Sound is muffled because there's pretty much no atmosphere here. Interesting. I guess they try to do that <laughs> physically correct. Ah, oh, goddammit. Stand freaking still for a second, thank you. Take the high ground. Thank you. Eh, no. Not quite. Ryder, the Valiant's sending more cats. Sarissa's almost there. Don't let up. You can handle it. Not the first time we had to tangle with a cat. Here. The 
enemies? Doesn't seem like it. Uh, but I'm running out of ammo for this weapon. What the hell are you doing? Need a weapon. skeleton crew, but enough to patch up the Ark. She'll make it to the Nexus. Whatever it cost. You need to talk to Sarissa about Ashara's message. I wanted to thank you both. That was exemplary work. I'm proud to... Ma'am? Sarissa? We know about Ashara. The log survived. Then her final moments her won't be final. lost. You deserted your Pathfinder. You should be better than... I chose protecting all these people over a single life. The choice they train us to make, Lieutenant. But you didn't tell anyone. Because then you wouldn't be their shining hero. And maybe that's how it should be. Being a Pathfinder means giving them hope. Ryder, you know this, don't you? I definitely do. I should have seen the Nexus when we first got there and um, how it is today. So, I'll, I'll be okay with keeping this quiet. It's over. Bringing up what happened won't do any good. Is that justice? Is that for you to decide? Sorry, but we need to prep for the Nexus approach. We've got a hell of a story for them. You should know... The Nexus is going to throw you the party of a lifetime. You can raise a glass to the Fallen. And to a better future. We don't walk an easy road. I hope we both find what we're looking for. Come on, Ryder. We're good here.
Hey, you okay? Can I just do today over again? Why would and you do something differently? And not run away from my duty. I put so much faith in Sarissa, but the Asari were just as lost as we are. I don't think we're we're classifying as lost anymore. We know our mission. I think we're finding our way pretty well. <laughs> Should have known better than to say that to a Pathfinder. Thank you for being there on the Lucinia. Can I tell you something? Sure. The old man was right to choose you as Pathfinder instead. I don't blaze a trail. I always look for the mentor, their plan. As a Pathfinder, my mistakes would be worse than Sarissa's. I think so. I think you've done some pretty amazing things, and uh, if we just keep at it, then maybe one day, when I think about retirement, we, we can talk about this again. You defended us on Habitat 7, found the Asari Ark, and fought the Ket, all without being a Pathfinder. That's just my job. And you're really good at it. Look, neither of us chose this, but maybe we both ended up where we needed to be. Even if we lost your father. But it's happened. If you can't outrun it, gotta use it. What did you... <clears throat> he said something like that once. Still true. I need to think of it. But I'll be okay. And on deck whenever you need me. Good to know. Alright. Want to talk about that some more? Back again? Any more commando war stories? I always liked Janae. She was only 200, and with me around, she wasn't the kid anymore. She was a biotic prodigy. I once saw her yank an AA gun right off its housing, crushed a gang of slavers with it. Nice. Ouch. They didn't feel it for long. Janae was a good friend. Maybe she still is back there. Won't be a kid now, though. All right. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. Sure. All right. Let's... Pathfinder, you have new email. All right. I want to say let's check the, um, the email terminal to see if we have email. I need to speak with you. From John. All right, I've received an update on Axel. It isn't good. Please come see me in my room. Yay. Thank you. From Cora. I mean it, thank you. Still sorting through everything, but it's easier since we talked. Sarissa owes us for this, but she owes but she owes it sh it memory even more. I still feel like an idiot, you know? Hang on to every word. But I get over it. Friends take the sting out of it. Meantime, let's hit some bad guys, shall we? Sure. Heading home from return to Daria. Hey right, remember me, Hideria? We talked uh, at that nice atlas of yours while I was taking care of evacuees from our arc. Uh, okay. Not anymore though, we're heading home. With Lucinia back at the Nexus, they've got the people in shots to, to get us back there. Alright, oh, right, right. Um, they're saying none of it would have happened without you. I believe them. Thank you for everything. Sure. No need to thank me. Let's speak with Jaw. You more than anyone know how dangerous Axul is. Why were they allowed to speak with him? They aren't children anymore. We can't control their every move. You remember how you were. Please, Jarl. I'll bring them home. I can come back if you need a moment. This is obviously a bad time. No. Please stay. My being alone won't help anything. Three of my brothers and sisters have joined the Rokar. Black Soul has poisoned them with his hatred of aliens. And your mothers want you to bring them back. 
The Roka have made camp at the forge. Many consider it the birthplace of our civilization. Aksul likely believes this bold move will create more fanatics for his cause. Ryder, he has my family. But I don't think I can do this alone. Sure, I'll help you. You don't have to. Just tell me the time and place. Hmm. No hesitation. You are a good friend. I have a contact who's been monitoring the Roka. I'll set up a rendezvous with her. Let's actually do that right away. On Haval. Or not, not, not sure if I actually wanted to go back to Haval right now, but... Sure, why not? I actually don't think we have fought... Have we fought an architect on Haval? Somehow I can't remember doing that. Oh, maybe we actually need to go back to Huval and um, see what's up there. I, 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 I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know. Subi, something to talk about. How's it going? I should get back to things. Sounds good. Apparently not. Hello, you got something to talk about? I hear you found a stasis locker from the Salarian Ark. Technically, someone else found it first, but yes. How wonderful! I know it's not the Ark itself. But any sign is better than nothing, surely. Please, if I can help the search at all, just ask. Or ask anyway. You're good company. <laughs> Tell me something else about the ship. Her engine's based on the Ark's Odyssey Drive, which got us through dark space. The core takes the static electricity it generates and stores it in capacitors. We basically make our own power supply. It took Serena and Tion weeks to get it working on a smaller ship. And a few electrical shocks. Tell me something else about the ship. Our aerospace engineer was Tian Ada Vasmore, a Quarian fellow, and absolutely fearless. Once, some Omega scrap dealer pulled the we don't sell to Quarians nonsense. Tion found a workaround. What did he do? He glued a memory foam to his environmental suit, then, during the negotiations, leaned against the drive core he wanted, very casual. It made a perfect mold of the components, and the scrap dealer was none the wiser. <coughs> what do you think of the rest of the crew? Liam's quite fun. Not many humans have that kind of energy. I probably shouldn't have told him there are secret compartments in the armory, though. He's been looking all day. What do you think of the rest of the crew? Dr. Tapero seems nice, if quiet. It must be very different here, compared to the Hyperion. Fewer people in stasis shock. Let's keep it that way. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Yeah. All right. So we got the Lysinia, which supposedly is right out there in front of us. Anyway, that went well, let's say. Uh, in the next episode, we'll probably return to Haval and do this uh, stuff for, for Jal and see if there's anything else we can do on Haval. We haven't been there for quite a while, so maybe something's come up, I don't know. But we'll be seeing that in the next episode. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time. Have a good one.